It's been really interesting and, and quite pleasing to see how much the craft people that we've been speaking to really seem to care about what they're doing and they really seem to care about the history and the tradition of what they're doing. And I think and I hope that one of the things that Crafting Futures can do is put on workshops for craftspeople to help them think about, okay, well, we're brilliant at making the product. How do we then run the business? How do we then make sure that we can employ people? How do we then make sure that, you know, we can, we can make, make money from this and, and reach international markets? The project's quite interesting because we've got two very different teams. We've got a team from the Royal College of Art whose background is much more technical in terms of understanding art. Um, and then there's a group of effectively sociologists from the School of Business trying to understand um, some of the processes of design, how uh, craft is organised. What I was really surprised is how much people care about craft, the craft makers, the passion and the love that they have for craft and the uh, aim that they have to continue the tradition. But it's not just about tradition, it's about innovating the tradition. We've been here, I think it's five days, um, and you know, we've packed a lot into every day. They've all been long, long days, and, um, but fascinating days. <laughs>